our foundation in Christ has been of key importance from the start. So it's likely Jared Flegel understands our verse of the day. Yes, a Christian foundation has long been a key component in the Flegel household, and it turns out swimming is a pretty regular component for the family as well. Matt Finkel has more. Thanks, Mark. Jared Flegel has been swimming competitively pretty much all of his life. As a homeschooler, the senior swam at the Mercer County YMCA for the past decade, and then two years ago, he joined Salina's swim team. And as I found out in this week's OIO Faith on the Field segment, his name is now in the WBL record books. When asked what he likes most about swimming, Jared didn't hide his competitive side. When all the hard works come together and you kick people's butt. <laughs> when it comes down to crunch time, he is the master. I mean, when he knows that competition's there and he's, you know, he's going to be pushed, he, he always swims up to the competition. That's exactly what happened at last week's WBL meet. Fliegel won the 100-yard butterfly and even surprised himself by setting the league record in the 200 freestyle. 200 free, that was like a, a happened on the spot kind of thing. I didn't see that one coming and, and here he took off and he said he got about halfway through the race and he was feeling good and he said, heck with it, I'm going to go for it. And, and he went for it, he just blew everybody out of the water. I mean, just by the time he hit the wall, I was double checking and, and he ended up with a league record. It's a great start to Fliegel's postseason and he hopes to qualify for state in the 100 butterfly and 200 free. Last year, Jared's trip to Canton didn't go as planned, so he's hoping his senior year will be special. Last year, we had a relay, and we would have got the school record, but we got DQ'd. So this year, I'm hoping to go back and put in the hard work and to go out with a bang for senior year. Butterfly, you know, with Tyus Temple being gone this year, I guess it's his turn to jump into that event and see what he can do in it. This year being his senior year, uh, I just think it would be awesome if he made it. Wiggle has always swam against good competition, including his own family. Jared is one of 10 kids, and his older brother Josh currently swims at Ohio State University. Last week, Josh was named the Big Ten Swimmer of the Week, and he's working towards competing for a spot on the Olympic team. Swimming, uh, yeah, we've, our whole family has been in it, so it's kind of like a trade thing. So all of us kind of bonded through swimming instead of different activities. Jared doesn't plan to swim in college, so this will be his final year competing. Fuegel's maturity and strong belief in God will carry him to success in whatever his next endeavor may be, just like it did in the pool. Yeah, I'd say faith goes into it a lot, um, where you're not exactly swimming with a lot of other people that have your same uh, idea of things, but it definitely keeps you motivated. You know what, he's a very sound religion. I mean, I know him and his family, that's one of the reasons that they homeschool their kids, is they want them to have that, that sound foundation. Uh, and for him, I, I know he's gonna be a success in whatever he decides to do. I mean, he's a good kid. We will be watching closely as Jared tries to make it to the state swim meet in Canton, and also keeping up with his brother Josh as he tries to qualify for a spot on the U.S. Olympic team. Certainly an exciting time for the Flegel family. Zach? 